Hello, welcome to another video of Campers.eu. In this video, we're gonna talk about the Volkswagen California and especially about sliding doors. Every Volkswagen California has a sliding door and uh, there are three different options in sliding doors. The standard one, the one with uh, the closing aid and the full electric one. And I thought it would be nice to go over these uh, different versions of the sliding door. Uh, so I hope you like this video. So the first one um, is the standard sliding door. This is a California Coast. The California Coast has the normal sliding door like you have on the Volkswagen Transporter. Um, you can recognize it as well from the, it's not color coded, the door handle. Uh, this, this works like every other sliding door. You just close it. You have to put in some force to close it nicely. If I do it slower, you see it will stick out a bit. So you have to put a little bit more force into it. And then it closes. Nothing wrong with it. And especially when the roof is open, it's pretty easy to do because the air can go out easily. Um, but for the, uh, for the coast, there's also an option. You can opt for the uh, closing aid on the sliding door and on the tailgate as well. And the uh, California um, Ocean has that as standard. So let's go and see how that works. So this is the California Ocean, as you can see from the electric roof and the uh, graphite interior. Um, this one has the, so every ocean comes with sliding door aid or uh, power aid it just helps to close the sliding door and um, i will close the door now you don't have to do it hard but you will see the last bit it will just close itself and this has been changed in the t6.1 generation it's even smoother than it was in the t6 uh, variant so let's do it from this side you see it closes very nicely and very silently. In the T6 generation, it, it, it made more noise and now it's very smooth, silky smooth. Um, and also as you, as you open it, it will come out easy. So one more time. I just focus from here. And you hear a little electronic sound that it, it pulls the door in. But there's another option. And this one is the fully electric sliding door. I also have an example of that here in the showroom. So I, I figured it's maybe wise to show that uh, maybe it's something for you, maybe not. Most people are content with uh, the normal uh, sliding door eight that the ocean has because you don't have to uh, close it that hard on the campsite. Uh, especially at night when people are sleeping uh, in the in the coach you have to uh, slide it pretty hard um, if you go if you if you're going to sleep at night or if you have to go to the toilet uh, and with the ocean already you can just close it very gently and it will close itself so you, you make less noise and this is the the full electric one um, now as it says if I just open the handle you see the door opens itself. You don't hear sound, you don't hear beeping, but if you close the door, if you close it from the door handle, like we do now, you hear two beeps indicating that it's closing, that you have to watch out. And then it closes. So again, very silent. Uh, there's another way to do that. Uh, that's with the key fob. On the key fob, there, uh, next, this is the, the button for the tailgate, and this is the button for the sliding door. If I press that, let me walk a little bit further backward and make it a bit brighter. There you go. So, if I and then closing. I don't know if you can hear it from the video. Uh, but there's a difference. Now, if I close the door from the key fob um, or from the dashboard, there's also a bu button on the dashboard. Uh, look, that's this one here. 
um, then it starts to beep constantly instead of two when you when it closes it closes uh, when you do it from the door handle it beeps twice and when you push from this button and uh, now let's open it and if I close it again then it starts to beep constantly I think you can hear that um, so that's a big difference um, especially when you're living on a campground you don't want to have that beeping sound constantly so it's wiser just to to close it with the door handle uh, then it's just a, a, it beeps twice and it closes uh, easily twice and closed That's the sliding door. That's all you need to know about the sliding door. There's one more option that uh, um, that you can add to a sliding door, and that is a, a, a sliding window in, in the sliding door. Uh, normally at the kitchen area, there is a sliding. Behind the driver's seat, there is a sliding window. But you can also add one in the, to the sliding door. Um, and for a lot of people, that is convenient because you get more air inside. But if you have an ocean, you have double glass windows in the back and you lose that double glass window if you add a sliding window. Now, that concludes everything about a sliding door. I hope you find this helpful in making a decision what suits you best. And uh, I hope to see you in the next video.